We're coming down to the wire here ahead of the August 9th primary. Campaigns are bringing out their top names. Former Vice President Pence stumping for Rebecca Clayfish today and former President Donald Trump will stump for Tim Michaels on Friday. Both will face each other in the Republican primary for governor. Political reporter Will Keneally was at today's Pence event and joins us now with more. So we've seen in recent endorsements, former President Donald Trump calling out Republicans as not true conservatives and endorsing the other candidates. At today's event, former VP Pence made the case that Clayfish meets those conservative credentials. It's one of the reasons why I'm so enthusiastic about Rebecca Clayfish, because she, she's going to lead uh, from conservative convictions here in Wisconsin. The former vice president looked to reaffirm for Republican primary voters that Rebecca Clayfish does have the credentials, despite the former president endorsing her primary opponent. And I am confident the people of Wisconsin know that your next governor needs to be a proven conservative who has stood in the pocket for Wisconsin in the past, and that's Rebecca Clayfish. This sets up an impending showdown between Pence and Trump who will visit Waukesha Friday to campaign for Clayfish's primary opponent, Tim Michaels. Clayfish said, though, the Pence endorsement speaks volumes. I am thrilled that he is here today and particularly to listen to our friends in law enforcement. Today's event was billed as a law enforcement roundtable. Clayfish is endorsed by 40 Wisconsin sheriffs and spoke to crime, which could be a big motivating issue for voters, especially in the Republican primary. We cannot afford skyrocketing violent crime in this state anymore, and that's what we'll get if we get Tony Evers for four more years. So like we said, this all comes ahead of former President Donald Trump's visit to Waukesha on Friday for Tim Michaels and ahead of next Tuesday's election. You can find deadlines and what you need to know before you go vote on our website at channel3000.com. Will, thank you.